guys, we're back. That's Olivia. That's Tiff. And that's Naylin. And we're here to bring you the hottest, the latest, the juiciest celebrity, celebrity news. news. Okay, first on our list, we have Kylie Jenner. Again. Ugh. Why are they always in the news? That was like pure hatred right there. Yeah, well, I, oh, I can't stand them, the Kardashians, but. I guess she said that she feels like she missed out on her childhood. Well, I kind of feel like that's Chris's fault, their mother. Right. Because I think their mom really pushed those girls to grow up and to be sleazy because that's just what's cool. So I kind of think that she needs to be blaming her mom, not everybody mm -hmm. else. What do you think? I mean, yeah, I think it's her mom's fault too because I think she played more of the role as the manager instead of the mother. Mm -hmm. A lot, a lot of times with all her kids, so I just feel like, you know, she should have been more the mother and be like, oh yeah, you know, let's have some good times and not always business, 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 and money, money, money. That's what they're always worried about. I kind of feel like, who cares, man? <laughs> no one cares <laughs> that you missed out on your childhood. Like, I don't care. You, you definitely don't care. No. I don't know if you care or not. I don't. I mean, I definitely bring, blame Chris. Like, she, she just has some problems that she has to deal with as a parent. Um, I also feel bad for her in a way, but like I feel like if you really missed out on your childhood, you would have been said something. You wouldn't have been like in a spot like enjoying it, like wearing makeup or coming out with your makeup line or wearing pumas or something like that or having a baby. I don't know. Like you should have been said something. It's like you always want to be in the spotlight. So like this is the next thing to make you in the spotlight. Yeah. I don't know. I just I don't really care about her. No. <laughs> so next we're going to talk about this disgusting couple that has come about. <laughs> yeah. Um, Ugh. Odell Beckham, who's so fine. So fine. Mm -hmm. Is dating. Can someone say her name because I don't want to. Iggy Azalea. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. I just, like, can y'all just take a minute to, like, think about Odell, oh. who's so fine. Dating Iggy. How did this happen? I don't like, know. She has a Iggy? mole right here. <laughs> like, why? That's what I makes just, her ugly. Something. I don't oh know. God. I just, I don't like Iggy. It's like, she's not ugly. I mean, she's not the prettiest, but. No, she's not <laughs> ugly. Yeah. It's just like, it's her. It's she's not, her. She's nobody. She's like, trying exactly. to be somebody. You can't mm -hmm. rap. You have one song. Oh, so bad. Exactly. That's your own yeah. song. And then. And she can't rap for real, she's like, that's how she be rapping. <laughs> you know, she can try again. I don't know. Like, she doesn't say words, like, she in her rap. So if she doesn't say words in her rap, what word is she saying in your relationship? Mm, that's, well, that's a good one. Thank you. Who'd she date for? Big Sean. Didn't she date him? No. No. It was, um, <gasps> Nick, it was Nick Young. He's oh, the, he's the best one. Yeah. So clearly that didn't work out, so she just needs to stop. Just go back to Australia, wherever she's from, and stay there. Mm -hmm. I heard that um, <laughs> her and Nick Young, they were engaged, right? Something like that. But oh. then he went back to his baby mama. Yeah, because he was Yeesh. cheating on her and, in and their house. Up. Yeah. Ooh. So, I mean, yeah. I just, Odell, I just want you to think about what you're doing. Because, I mean, you just, you're so fine. I just want you to run. Yeah, in your date. I just want you to run. I mean, just like stay on the field or something. Like, just don't, don't, right. you don't need a run relationship away. right now. It's fine. You know, get out. <laughs> wink, wink. You know what I'm talking about. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to move on to the third subject. Um, what's our third subject, guys? The Disney oh, Channel. Yes, the Disney Channel, which no one watches anymore, is coming out with their first gay storyline. Mm -hmm. On a show called Andy Mac, I think it's their second yeah, season, right? Yeah, is it? I don't even know that show. Either. I don't mean, I, I saw either. that it was season two. I'm like, know. what is this? I think the thing with Disney Channel is, I definitely think more people watched it in our age group. Like, yes. whenever we were younger, I think the shows were better. Mm -hmm. I think that they had more like, more like relatable. Yeah. Now, and it was just fun and funny yeah. about it. Now I kind of feel like, not saying that it's a bad idea, but I kind of think that what if the kids don't understand, or like, I don't really feel like that they're target audience. Right. Like, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. I mean, I definitely think it's amazing. I think it's just on the wrong network. Like, I don't, mm -hmm. no one watches the Disney Channel. We haven't even heard of Andy Mac. It's on a second season, so there was a first one, apparently. How is it making it? I don't That's know. That's the real question. Like, maybe I think- they need that. Maybe they're trying to target 
like older people into watching with their kids or like a baby like I don't know like I don't I get what they're trying to do with Disney Channel like first they try to come out with like all color programs like they brought back that so Raven and then they had Casey undercover mm -hmm. and now you're coming out with like a gay storyline which is amazing because it's like things that are like prominent today life, right? yeah that we should be talking about but like should we t be talking about it on the Disney Channel no. I feel like, like they're just not going to understand it quite yet. I know no. parents are supposed to tell their kids about this type of stuff, but I just feel like, yeah, they're kind of, it's too young. Them, why is that, like, you know, I don't know, I'll be confused. Mm -hmm. Or they probably just won't even, like, understand. Yeah, yeah, they just won't know what's going on. I mean, I think it's amazing. I think you need to move it to, like, Fox or something. <laughs> I don't know, ABC, just a different network. Mm -hmm. No one watches the Disney Channel. It's right. not the same. It's like a desert. Mm -hmm. don't, don't it's like a desert. Like, I used to binge watch Disney Channel. Right. So did I. Now I, like, turn it on to go to sleep. I don't even watch that channel. I, I didn't even know Disney Channel was still there. So I'm just going to say, no, Wow. But, yeah, it's just not the same. All right. Well, I mean, it's just like a sad day for celebrity news. But. Yeah. Nothing <laughs> good been happening at all. Well, guys, that's all we have for now. Up next, we have Mercedes closing out the night with industry news.